U.S. may directly intervene in the war in Ukraine. Washington is currently the option of direct intervention in the hostilities in Ukraine. This was suggested by the American investigative journalist, Pulitzer Prize winner Seymour Hersh. In his opinion, such a development of events is possible if there are visible prospects for the defeat of Kyiv. At the same time, he said, the United States will cover itself with the fact that it is not them, but NATO that is conducting offensive operations against the Russians. Do you really want to get into a fight with these guys? Don't think. It seems to me that we are not ready, said the publicist, noting that Russia has not even used its main forces in Ukraine yet. Earlier, the Washington Post reported that the West doubts the ability of the armed forces of Ukraine to attack due to the loss of trained units and lack of ammunition. The author of the article pointed out that the failure of Ukraine to launch an offensive could lead to criticism of the United States and Europe for delaying the deepening of training programs and the supply of combat vehicles, including Bradley and Leopard tanks. In November 2022, The Hill columnist Seth Cropsey predicted that the United States and its allies could decide to intervene directly in the conflict in Ukraine using the provisions of the NATO Collective Defense Treaty. He pointed out that the reason for the intervention could be, for example, Russian strikes near the Polish-Ukrainian border to disrupt the supply of Western weapons, as a result of which Poland would suffer. The publicist also admitted that Russia could attack ships, violating the terms of the grain deal, or even provoke the destruction of the Zaporozhye nuclear power plant. However, he himself called such a scenario unlikely.